This is today's WWE NXT Full Show Results video, and the show started with a match between Nathan Fraser vs Wesley for the NXT North American Championship, and the result of this match was Wesley defeated Nathan Fraser by pinfall to retain the NXT North American Championship. The next match happened between Briggs and Jensen vs Indus Sure, and the result of this match was Indus Sure defeated Briggs and Jensen by pinfall with a show tee from Veer Mahan on Brooks Jensen. Post-match, Jinder Mahal gets on the mic to cut a promo on the Creed brothers for denying the NXT Universe and Indian Champion last week and says they haven't been able to overcome them and challenges them to a trios match next week. Then Gigi Dolan makes her entrance and gets on the mic and said isn't the first time her life has changed or that she's had her head kicked in by someone she trusted. Gigi said Jane knows that the last person Gigi let beat her down like that was her own mother and when she ran away from home as a teenager she was trying to show her little brother that she could make it in WWE, and she's been knocked down time and time again and she gets back up every time. Bring everything you have at Roadblock because it won't be enough, and she'll hammer the final nail in the coffin of toxic attraction. Then we saw students of Chase U University talking to each other, and then Chase takes the podium and gets interrupted by a projector video by the schism running Chase U down and promising to leave the university in flames. Andre gets fired up about it and tells the schism he's gonna show his students the principles he stands for when he shows Joe Gacy and Andre Chase University-sized s whooping. Back from commercial, the Creed brothers are walking backstage discussing a potential unnamed tag partner, and we saw Braun Breaker asked Creed's to join them for next week against Indus Shur and Jinder Mahal, and Creed agreed. The next match happened between Mako Satamira vs Zoe Stark, and the result of this match was Mako Satamira defeated Zoe Starks by pinfall with Scorpio Rising, and post-match, Perez gets up from commentary to have a face-off with her challenger for next week. The next match happened between Electra Lopez vs Sol Ruka, and the result of this match was Sol Ruka defeated Electra Lopez by pinfall. Post-match, we saw some heat between Valentina Furaz and Electra Lopez, and Lopez pushed Valentina Furaz, and the Valentina Furaz knocks out Electra Lopez with the knuckle duster. The next match happened between Katana Chance vs Tiffany Stratton, and the result of this match was Tiffany Stratton won the match by pinfall with a double jump moonsault. Post-match, Tiffany gets on the mic and calls Roxanne Perez and Mako Satamira out, saying that she doesn't care who wins next week, because the NXT Women's Championship belongs to her. The next match happened between Axiom vs Hank Walker, and the result of this match was Axiom won the match by pinfall with the golden ratio. In the main event of the show, we saw a match between Carmelo Hayes vs Tyler Bate, and the result of this match was Carmelo Hayes defeated Tyler Bate by pinfall with the help of Trick Williams' interference, and the show goes off air.